here's a special Father's Day book called We Help Daddy. One of my favorite illustrators again, Eloise Wilkin. This book originally belonged to Beth. Beth, if this is your book, let me know. And the copy right here is 1962. And she would like to thank Cynthia, James, and Kimball who posed for the pictures. We help Daddy a lot, Benji and I. Daddy fixes the attic door. He calls, hammer please. Benji hands him the hammer. Then Daddy says, Sue, are you ready to help me too? I am Sue, so I hold out my hands to show I am ready. I bring the tin plate and Benji puts the old rusty nails in it. You are a help, Daddy says to us. In the garden, Daddy and Benji pull out weeds. I pull out weeds too. I see a nice little snail. When he sees me, the snail puts his head under his shell. Now we must water the plants, Daddy says. Benji turns on the faucet. We help Daddy water the big flowers. I water the pink geranium with my very own little watering can. The hedge needs a haircut, Daddy says. Daddy picks up the shears and clip, clip, clip. The hedge is neat and tidy. Benji gathers the clippings and throws them into the wastebasket. I help him. Our dog Zip needs a bath. His paws are muddy and he has some burrs on his coat. Zip does not like baths, he runs away. Benji and I catch him. I wash his wiggly ears. Benji soaps his curly coat. Daddy washes Zip all over. Poor Zip looks so unhappy. We splash warm water all over Zip and then we rub him dry. Now Zip is nice and clean. The kitchen fence needs a coat of paint, says Daddy. Benji brings the paintbrush. I spread newspaper so that Daddy can put the paint can on it. We can see Mommy baking in the kitchen. She waves to us and says, hello, busy bees. Daddy dips the brush in the can and paints the rails. I run and get my own little paintbrush. Now I can help too. We have a new picture to hang, calls Mommy. We all go into the living room. Benji and I hold the picture up. Daddy puts wire cord through the two rings. Daddy climbs the stepladder. I give him a hook to fix in the wall. Then up goes the picture. It's hanging all crooked, said Benji. Daddy straightens the picture and says, thank you, Benji. Next, we decide to make a bird feeder. Daddy has a wooden tray for the bottom. I need two pieces for the sides. He says, Benji hands him the wood and Daddy saws it in two. I help Benji keep hold while Daddy nails one piece of wood on each side of the tray. Then he nails the roof on and puts a big hook in it. I put breadcrumbs and seeds on the tray and we hang it near the kitchen window. We watch the birds eat. Let's get some logs for the fire, says Daddy. Benji and I push the wheelbarrow along. Daddy chops the logs and we pile them on the wheelbarrow and take them to the house. Our next job is to clean the car. Daddy takes the hose and splashes the car all over. Benji and Daddy wipe it dry. I help too. Hmm, we need to polish, said Daddy. Daddy polishes the front. Benji polishes the sides. I polish the door handle. See how the car shines, said Benji. I'm glad I've got such good helpers, said Daddy with a smile. Last of all, we have to mend the handle on Benji's dresser. Where's the screwdriver, asks Daddy. Benji finds a screwdriver for Daddy. Daddy takes off the broken handle and screws on the new one. Thank you, Daddy, says Benji. Wash your hands for supper, Mommy calls. Benji sees a nail sticking out of the bathroom door. That must come out before someone gets hurt, said Daddy. I'll get the pliers, said Benji, and Daddy pulls the nail out. What would I do without my helpers, Daddy says to Mommy. After supper, we are very, very sleepy. We had such a busy day helping Daddy. Mommy tucks us into bed and said, Daddy and I are so pleased with, you, with our two helpers. Benji and I are very pleased too. Helping Daddy is fun the end. Hope you enjoyed that fun vintage throwback of traditional family roles. Um, cute little fond memories it brings back.